Okay, well, we're going to see how this goes. I've already turned the graphics down, like, all the way here. I'm still getting an encoding overloaded in OBS, but hey, I'm here. Dragon Age Inquisition. Gonna play Jaws of Hack on today. He doesn't seem to be lagging too much this time. Don't know what it looks like to you guys, but... Best I can really do. I already turned everything down all the way. So this weekend I tried multi-streaming. Put a little Origins. Um, stream to be streaming Twitch. Just for an hour. Just to see what it was like. And well. I'm definitely not going to be doing it you know, with Inquisition. At least you know. Because if this is the way Inquisition's going to be acting, my computer's going to be acting while doing Inquisition. Okay. Too bad I can't use the Sentinel plate and there's no um, schematics for it. I was looking. Let's see if there's any other um, things. But now I can judge Samson. Pellmeyer, Hintelins, Plate Inquisition numbers. Where's the Frostback? Oh, there it is. Okay. Uh, with most of our forces still returning from the Temple of Mithal, it is important that our enemy not suspect the weakness of our current state. I can take some of the charges on patrol Inquisition uniforms and create enough of a disturbance to give enemy scouts the impression of a much larger Inquisition force. Lieutenant Cremisius, a classy. And he's a classy man. Uh, I'm going to let Liliana handle this one. Inquisitor. Meanwhile. No, I should talk to people first before. Yeah, I should talk to people. I, I should really talk to people. I'm not going to do what I did last week and put just an image of myself up. Keep forgetting to take the, do the pictures. As you can see, I also updated my model. My head was looking too small for some reason. At least in my coat, so I, um... Made my head bigger. I know, just what I need, a swelled head. Actually, you know what? You can have that solace for reasons. I'm going to go throw stuff into the uh, chest here. Then go talk to companions, at least the ones I travel with. I'll try to talk to all of them, though. Now we wait for that to load. Okay, that's everything. 
It's still saying encoding overloaded. But I'm still waiting out 60 frames per second. Everything looks fine. I don't know. If it continues like this, I might just uh, record the rest of the game and do that like once a week. Just post it. Okay, no. We'll see how well it looks this week. So let's talk to my companions. I'm... Let's talk to Eric. Let's go this way. Your worship. So, I'm still trying to wrap my mind around this. We went to an ancient yep. room where you consumed a pool of elven elfiness. Yeah. And then walked through a mirror. Yep. And wound up back here. Have I mentioned yeah. the shit that happens to you is crazy? I don't want to think about this anymore. You want to discuss something normal? See you later, Eric. See you later, Eric. I already talked to Solus. Okay, he's just doing his artwork. I am now the elfiest elf to ever elf. Just saying. After last week. Have I talked to Dorian about this yet? I think so. The Inquisitor's work is never done, I see. Nope. I need to talk to you. Oh. I am, as you say down south, all ears. It's still rude to say. I was hoping to steal a moment alone with you. You have but to ask. Alatus. Lead the way. Hmm, I need to kiss. I need it. Okay, let's go talk to Viv. About all this. It's been quite the momentous day, hasn't it, my dear? Yeah, How did you feel? that's our last week. It's not every day one absorbs ancient elven magic. Uh, I'm getting used to it. It was strange at first, but I think I'm all right now. Good. We can't have you falling to pieces on the eve of such an important battle. Yeah, going into the Rossback Basin. Are nearly in place. We'll soon strike against Corypheus directly. You've done well. I will be proud to fight alongside you when the time comes. That's good. Because uh, you will be fighting alongside me. You're part of my party. Whee! Oh. oh. Oh, yeah. Now you notice you landed. Hard. Cass? Victory in the Arbor Wilds. The Archdemon might have been a real threat to our army, but it flew off once we turned the tide. That's good. It is still out there, however. I wonder what Corypheus plans now. Uh, hopefully he just runs and hides. He'll hide. What other choice does he have? Do not underestimate Corypheus. He is powerful, and you have yet to fight him one on one. But he will come. You will get your chance. Eh, probably right. It wouldn't be any fun if all this was over so soon. Corypheus believes himself a god. Pride alone demands he not slink off into the shadows. I have faith you will be victorious even so. So do I. Because I've played this game multiple times. I know I'll be victorious against him. Not long ago, this was impossible to imagine. 
You, a valued friend, victory close at hand. The time has come to consider what will come next. Oh, don't jinx it right now. This is a bad idea. Bad idea. We still have to beat Corypheus. I have not forgotten. Blessed are they who stand before the corrupt and the wicked and do not falter. You have come far, my friend. It has been an honor. Okay, I'm going to do the rest of this after the Jaws of Hackon. A lot of this seems like goodbye stuff. Like well. I don't want to say goodbye everybody yet. I'm gonna do the Jaws of Hackon. Then we can do the goodbye stuff. And then when we're done with that. When we're done with that, then Then I might head into the hissing wastes. I, I really don't want to head there. It's a boring place. Sand. Lots of sand. And after that, more sand. And then more sand after that. Maybe a rock or two here or there. Maybe a chanter there or here. But mainly sand. Minimum suggested the 20. To Ambassador Josephine Montelier. We'll be spread thin until the rest of our forces return from the Arbor Wilds. Of course. Thank you for so much for your earlier correspondence. I confess it's been difficult to get those Norlay to take this discovery seriously in light of recent events, but I am positive that scouting the Frostback Basin will yield historic discoveries beneficial to both the academic field and the Inquisition. As a staunch supporter... I am honored to be working in such great company on this historic occasion. Yours most sincerely, Professor Bram Kenrick, University of Orlais. Uh, we've scouted the region, set up camp. Professor Kenrick has, has, has scouts gathering anything they can find. So far, we've uncovered a lot of very old buckles. Hopefully this yields something more exciting. Anyone who comes here should be ready for hostile wildlife and angry Avar. 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 Avar, me hearties. This place is dangerous. Scout Harding. Dorian. Not Dorian. Also not Dorian. I got two of these people aren't are 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 aren't Dorian. Mm. Oh, my back. So how's everybody's weekend? Mine was pretty good. Had fun, went out, did stuff. Sat in the car for quite a bit. Longer than I wanted to. But, had fun. Checked out a couple of places I hadn't been before. Um, had a decent dinner, at least one. That's my multi-stream. 
Got to gotta be able to go outside and get a nice good walk in the sunlight. It's sunny right now. I kind of want to go out there, but I have my stream. And I kind of wanted to, you know, stream. Oh, no. I think I'm stuck. I think my camera just went off. Um, I think my tracking just crashed. No, my camera tracking is still open. My camera's off, though. Huh. That's weird. My camera is literally off. I do not see it. Again, inquisitor, inquisitor. Allow me to introduce Professor Bram Kenrick. He's the reason we're out here. A pleasure to meet you, Your Worship. A pleasure. Professor Kenrick teaches at the University of Orlais. I came on an exchange program from Starkhaven. While in Val Royo, I found something incredible. Ah, uh, a nice hat. After hundred years, we may be able to determine the final resting place of the last Inquisitor. Me? Inquisitor Ameridan, what? The texts say that Inquisitor Ameridan was a dragon hunter who vanished on his last expedition. Yes, precisely. I see you've read Latrec's Precursors to the Chantry. Totally. Inquisitor Ameridan Just skimmed down it. shortly before the Navaran Accord brought the Seekers of Truth into the Chantry. He hunted demons, dragons, and dangerous apostates in a time before Templars even existed. Mm. I'm all for his it means tracking down the equipment of a famous demon hunter. My well, loot does sound good. Get your mind in the right place, Scout Harding. Scout Harding, you had me at equipment. Thought you might like that. Your scouts have gathered artifacts from the area. They may help us discover what Inquisitor Ameridan was doing. I have news as well. We've encountered hostile Avar okay, to the north. Heck, they call themselves that, the that Jaws weird. of Hakon. Oh, great. Wonderful. There's also an Avar hold to the east. Unlike the Jaws of Hakon, they've been friendly so far. The Jaws of Hakon? They're hostile Avar who attack any Inquisition agents or researchers who get close. We've sent soldiers for defense, but the Hakonites are cunning, merciless, and know the basin better than we do. Wonderful. I'm afraid our men will not be able to hold out long. I should go. Safe travels. Okay. So. I do like the Frostback Basin. It's a very lovely place. Getting a lot of lag again, but I can't turn my graphics any lower. Professor? Lady I mean, Scout Harding has an impressive team. I think somebody's got a crash. Hopefully safe ones. We've had bad luck with artifacts before. I hope none of them explode. What? No, no, I, I don't mean magical artifacts. I meant belt buckles and old nails and the like. Oh, okay. Cloth and leather will have long since rotted away. Only metal and stone remain recognizable. Complicating this are recent pieces the Avar left behind. And, of course, ancient pieces dating back to Tevinter. Fortunately, thanks to some period-specific buckling, I've been able to track our last Inquisitor. Period-specific buckling? Huh. You lost me at buckling. You'd think that a buckle was a buckle. But ever since people started belting on weapons, they've been adding bits. One piece here has a dragon engraving. With the alloys of the metals used, it's clearly to winter. While this one uses a clasp that wasn't invented until the dawn of the Elysian Empire. And when it comes to historical research, you might say we have to buckle down. <laughs> Wonderful. So, to winter? You said there were pieces dating back to to winter. Yes. While it's rare to see Tevinter ruins so far south, the Imperium once had an outpost of some sort here. 
they might have built it as a, a ritual site. I'm not sure what military value it could have. In any event, it's muddled up the research slightly, but I've accounted for it. So, what you find? What do you have, Professor? Everything so far points to the shore, not far to the south. There was some sort of battle near the shoreline. They were in a hurry. The scouts reported an island near an Avar fishing camp, but the Avar won't say much about it. Okay, so tell me about these Avar at the Can camp. You tell me about the Avar fishing camp. Not much. It's the friendly Avar, not these jaws of Hakon barbarians. According to the scouts, they wouldn't say much about the area. Likely a local superstition. In this battle? What makes you think the last Inquisitor was fighting? There's a clasp here common to armor links. It's clearly torn. That only happens from a heavy shearing blow, like large claws or an axe. Then there's the dagger. Silverite, with a stylized dragon pommel and an inscription reading Cordillus. That dagger had to be a gift from Cordillus Dracon, first emperor of Orlay. No one would just... <laughs> Lose. I lost like three on the way into this room. I don't know what you're talking about. Well, I guess I'll have to go investigate that island. To that island and see if there's anything useful there. Excellent. I'll continue to study what's been found. With luck, we'll both find some answers. Hopefully. Also, one of my research assistants, Colette, was investigating an old structure to the north. I'm not certain it's related to our investigation, but it couldn't hurt to check with her. Okay. I got stuff to do. So. Let's. Let's see if we can deal with some of these, um. Hack knights here. I think that's important, making sure our, our men are safe and the researchers can, well, do their job. Many see the Inquisition as the only hope against the breach. Ooh. We've received a number of donations. I'll take some of those. Oh, no. I kill Aram. Somebody's been using tranquil skulls again. Poor tranquil. Well, that was easy. Look at that pretty bird. I like this place at this point in the game. Later in the game, I don't like it. But that's because this part's taking place like during the evening and then there's a part that takes place during the night and it's dark and you can't see how pretty it is over here anymore. Ugh, sorry. Woke up way too early this morning. Come back for those later. Thanks for shoving me off the tree, guys. I scouted the area. Hmm. 
Meanwhile, I gotta go find some Hackenites. Now, I don't like these guys. They have, like... AC bits. So it takes a little while to fight them. More time than I want. But, you know, it's a very pretty area. But then again, I like trees. I like being out in the trees. So many pretty trees. Some Everite. That mages. What? There's lowlanders here? Where? I'm just flying all over the place today, aren't I? You, get over here. Elf smash. Yeah, this is really affecting my, um, fighting right now. Kill the Inquisitor. What do these jaws of Hakon have against me? Against me? Perhaps the friendlier Avar in the village Harding mentioned can shed some light. Way too many spiders. I'm going to say, I'm going to see if I can figure out what I can do here. If I can turn down anything else. Because this is really... Gotta be at low. That's very low. I think it's what the soft. I think it's Warudo giving me the grief today. I think if I turned that off, I'd be having no problem. But okay. I'm just gonna exit for now. Um. 
yeah, that's about all I can do, I guess. Is yes, I'm just gonna um restart with the texture quality at the, the very low end. See if that helps. I mean, that's the only thing I can think of right now. I can't do anything to my encoding right now. And that one fight is going to make the fights take forever if I do it the other way. Huh. Okay. Well, I turn that off. I'll not have a second here. I'm not putting my light on. Okay. That's not going to help. See if there's anything I can do to help. I don't think there's anything I can do here either. Okay. Sorry about that. I had closing something out more Rudo. Oh, I can see through my shirt. Oh. That's kind of fun being able to see through my shirt. Seeing through myself. You know what? I'm going to go to do what I did last week with the picture. I'm just going to get a good picture of myself. So, yeah, that's what I'm going to do right now. Because I cannot do combat. With that kind of lag. Even on easy. I don't like doing this, but... Might be the only option I got. So I'm going to get a picture of my model with a transparent background for this. I don't have anything readily available. I know I should, but I don't. Because I'm lazy. Okay, let me just... Do this. Do... do, do. Um... Not that pose. What is that on my arm? I'm going to check that later. Sorry. I'll do that one. Okay. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to do something different soon. So I'll be adjusting my schedule soon, I think. Okay, I'm just going to put this in here. Now 
Ja. Okay, we're gonna set this up. Doing this in real time. Gonna try to at least get somewhat close here. Okay, that'll work. Okay, oops. Um, one more thing I want to do. Okay, start the game back up. Hopefully, hopefully this works. I can't get text. I can't get the quality any lower, and I think it's this. It's, it's Waruto, and I do not want to go back to VC phase after using something like this, but I might have to. I'll do a test stream later on this week. I'm just waiting for the game to load, so I'm gonna. Let's go back here. As you can see, now I've got that. And I'm just gonna close Warudo right now because I think that's causing the, the issues. Yeah, yeah, I saved the changes. I really think that's causing the issues. I don't like having to do this, but there's no way I'm going to be able to do combat like that. I mean, it seems to be working better. I can turn up my the graphics back up, so I'm going to leave it as is for now. But I'm not going to be able to fight like that, so I have to turn everything down. I'm going to turn the texture quality back up, though. So at least get to low quality. I don't know why it's doing it that this week. Okay. More poison spiders, huh? I am sending myself flying a lot right now. I hate these spiders. That's one thing I hate about this area, it's like all the spiders. Like way too many of them. Between the... Inquisition soldiers. With a few more hack knights than strictly necessary. Oh, definitely. Way too many. Elf smash! Oh, any time in time. Lieutenant Farrell. 
back those Hakonite bastards. My men and I will hold here. The Hakonites along the river still pose a threat. After this last battle, we need time to fortify and regroup. So what's the situation? What's the situation along the river? Between the Hakonites and the wildlife, this isn't the easiest place to maintain a presence. The river's the best way for the Inquisition to send supplies from Skyhold. Or it would be if we could travel safely along it. The Hakonites set up camps near the banks, and they attack anyone who gets within view. Okay then, well... That will be all, Lieutenant. Sir? Then we'll take care of that as soon as we get there. Excuse me. Okay. That one's the first one, I guess. More spiders. Poor Tusket. Yeah, poor Tusket. Okay. Nestrarium. I'm not going to worry about that one yet. If I hadn't already started this, uh, I'd probably just go to end the game. And then do Trespassers, like, you know, VODs. There you guys are. Hi! Can I join in on this party? Even in the middle of nowhere, we find fanatics. Lucky us. Yeah. But at least we're, you know... We're not the fanatics, I guess. Next one. There's a rift there. I do not want to deal with a rift yet. Gonna be right on the other side here, so let's do some scouting. Okay. Hi. I'll smash. I'm getting some good material crafting materials out of this. Spiders.
Okay. There we go. I'm missing our model move. I'll take a break after I get this quest done, I think, and see if I can figure out something. There's a camp up this way. I'm going to set the camp up. Good idea. How does it feel to be being beaten by an elf, huh? I think they're down there, if I remember correctly. I think we're, like, right on top of them. Oh, definitely, I hear, uh, I hear mages. Oh, this is making me dizzy. Making me very dizzy. Some over there. Oh, good, I got potions. Keep forgetting to do that on my sky hold. Uh, some people say the Avar gods bless the Hakonite's weapons. Even our run-ins with them, I'd say the Hakonites see it that way. Keep to your patrol, stay focused, and remember what to report in the scheduled. If we get a hold of any of their blades, we'll want Grandin or Archive to take a look. They know magic. Okay, so I want to go back down. Where is the lift? Is that the lift? Lift. No, no, there's like one that's like right on top of an Avar camp. Whoop. Might as well just uh, finish the job. Oh, they even got a mage. A couple, uh, two-handers and a mage, huh? Elf smash! Okay. Nope, before that spider comes to us. Or that one. Or all these ones.
still talking. I think that's going to repeat for quite a while. Okay. So many of them. Oh, great. And more Hackenites over here. I do not like all these Avar. It's actually one of the problems I have with this DLC. When I turn to Lieutenant Pharaoh, let him know it's okay to order the fries and the frosty stuff. You gotta order a supply from Skyhold. If I was trying to avoid the spiders, I'm done with fights for a little bit. Then I'm gonna at least see if I can put VC face on or something. Uh, that's a good point. Inquisitor. River secure, the Lieutenant. The were pushed back from the river. That will put mines at ease, sir. I'll arrange patrols for the area. It's no Imperial Highway, but we'll see people along as safely as we can. Thank you. you all, Lieutenant. Sir. Okay. I'm going to take a break and see if I can get something um, working here so I can actually have my model moving again. So uh, I'll be back in a second. I'll see you on the flip side. Let's see if this works. Once I get the, the game in the foreground. Okay. Now. What I think I should do is set up the camps. So I'll probably run into some fights here. Um, basically, I'm not using the webcams to track right now. I'm, I'm back to the setup I had prior to starting Warudo. I mean, I, like, I love Warudo, but I'm back to VC face right now. I was just like, I, I can't. I can't do it with that lag, even at the lowest possible settings. What's that one? I love how there's a camp right there that's just... Oh, that's the one I already went to. Okay. Now, I'm going to go to this one next, I guess. I'm going to set up my camps. Ah! 
Okay, I can at least play. Oh, that's good. I'll just have to use this, uh... So far, it seems to be working. So far. Will it continue working? Who knows? I am not going to find out. Okay, here is where we have the test. Elf smash! Okay, seems to be working. Okay. We put our weapons back. Should be safe. I think there was something up on, on on those, but I don't remember. Oh, more. More Jaws of Hack on. Okay, so far so good. One particularly difficult fight, but... I think we're good. I am just flying all over the place today! I hate these spiders so much. Mainly, I just hate being next to the river. Normally, I would love to be next to the river. But these spiders are so annoying. Just gotta remember, at least they don't jump on my face. Oh, great. I'm gonna save right here. I'm going to close this rift. L smash the demon. Oh, one of you. I hate those ones. They, 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 they teleport. Elf smash. I mean, at least I get some good uh, crafting materials out of it. I'm always happy with that. I'm going to finish setting up my camps. Uh, 
Oh, Ty. I think I just sent it something launch. I'm, I'm just launching stuff now. Bogfisher. That's what I'm going after. Poor Bogfisher. I don't like fighting the Bogfishers. They don't do nothing. They're just herbivores. Just herbivores doing the herbivore thing. I don't like doing that. Okay. Next camps are all the way over here, so... I can fast travel there, so I'm gonna go do that one. I'm gonna fast travel there. Okay, the, this bloody river. Get away from it before I get attacked by more spiders. I know I'll get attacked by Hackenites. I always get attacked by Hackenites. But spiders. Spiders are annoying. Don't worry, Mr. and Mrs. Tuskit. I'm not gonna I'm not here to harm you. I like you guys. What I don't like are spiders. They're overly aggressive. And they like eating my face. And I do not think my face is all that tasty. Honestly, I don't. I mean, I've never tried my face. Um, and eating face, and eating a chunk of my face would just be, uh, um, I think, a waste. Okay. Where's the lift? Lift. Okay, and then there's a landmark over here. Spiders right here. Can't pull any of, any of these things over here to me. Probably up there. Okay. Can we avoid the spiders, please? Um, I hope so. We're just gonna disengage. And continue to be disengaged. I do not want to go after all these spiders all the time. Okay, we're out of range. Get all my camps established here. Then I'm going to work on clearing the rift so we can work here. Don't attack it. Not doing nothing. Just doing its tuskety things. 
It does whatever a tusk it does. Okay, good. Okay, next. Let's take care of these fade rifts. That way we can at least travel without having to worry about demons. We're going to have enough problems here in the uh, basin without demons. Hi, Mr. Bogfisher. See, look it. It's not doing anything. I can get right up. I can pet this big pig thing if I wanted to. It doesn't care. I don't want to hurt it. It don't care about me. I don't care about it. I think we're both doing that just fine. Okay. Okay, I need to save that for later. That's got to go for later. And I know what that lever does. There's the rift. I knew there was one around by a ruined house. Ooh, a pride demon. Come on! Come on! No. Bad pride demon. Come here, pride demon. Supposed to let me launch ya. Hi. Mind if I bring you over here? Oh, a terror demon, huh? At least I get some, you know, a good amount of crafting materials. Okay, where is it? That way. Can I get down easily? Sort of. I mean, I can get down really easily if I just, you know, ignore the fact that I'm going to take fall damage from doing it. And honestly, I choose to ignore fall damage. My body doesn't, but I do. Hi!
There we go. I got him. I got him. I wish I could set that up. Is there something else over here? Oh, it's just smell fruit. Well, now we go this way. I get to that other rift. Let's avoid the spider. Maybe I'll eat a Hackenite instead. I mean, that would be nice, wouldn't it? Or not. Okay, it's up this way, so... I'm not going to worry about the glands. Because that's all I'd be looting, or, you know, fang, you know, research items, or glands, and... Are you still afraid of me, Vivienne? Are you still talking? Okay. Will you stop doing the same audio all the time? So I want to close this rift. That is what I am here to do. Here it is. I hate the spear demons. Get your butt back here so I can kick it. I said, back here, kick it. It's getting annoying. Are you sure you want to annoy me right now? I'm having a rough day. The tech is not working right. And you guys are slitting about. Not letting me kick your butts. Next. Beautiful area, though. So at least there's that. It'd be even better if there weren't all these Hackenites. But what are you going to do, huh? You're in Avar territory. Of course, you're going to fight some Avar. Some hostile Avar. I mean, they're home. Right? Right. I am in their home. As long as it doesn't come after me, we're good. We're going to let the circle of life take its uh, 
or chart its own course over here. If they don't attack me, I'm not going to attack them. Anyways, we'll do an, we, 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 we're doing enough damage to the environment over here already. Leaving belt buckles and nails all over the place. Oh, hi. Can I launch a pride demon? L smash! Okay, one of you guys. Trying to get away from me? Stay down! I hate these things so much. Especially in big open spaces. Another one? Uh, I hate the spare demons. I really do. I really, really hate the spare demons. Okay. And that one is down in there, I believe. Oh, no, it's on the other side of down in there. Is it? I, think, I don't remember. Okay, it's the other side of this gorge. Sorry, Mr. Tusket. I don't remember if it's down there or not. Hmm. Oh, cliffside camp. Everyone will get their potions recharged anyways. I think it's on the other side of this. I don't remember though. Is that way up here? Yes, there is. I love those birds, they're beautiful.
They're beautiful birds. Okay, come on. Where is it? Please do not be in that. In that swamp. I will get trapped there. I tend to get tra trapped in the swamps. Okay, I figured while I was right there. Oh, now I remember where it is. It's on a ruin, or in a ruin. Or around a ruin. It's a pain in the butt, that's what it is. Over here in this ruin. Right in there. No, I think they can't hurt you, Cole. Okay, I might actually take care of this one easily enough. Dorian, what's a slave? Festus Biomo Canavero. But you said I could ask questions. That's true. Just go ask the Inquisitor this one. Yeah, don't ask me right now, Cole. Let me close this breath first. I gotta deal with. But first, I want to get down here. Don't want to go there yet. I just hope Cole does not want to become a slave. Okay, now I want to go this way. So let's go to Ridge Line. Ah. 
Mm. I'm going to take another quick break after um, I get these two rifts done just so I can maybe turn my graphics back up a little bit. Now that things are working for you know, a minute. Now that I got things working for a minute, I want to turn my graphics back up a little bit. They don't need to be at their absolute lowest. I can at least turn it up to medium. Okay. As long as we're nobody's being hostile to the tuskets or the bog fishers. They're endangered species. No, they're not. There it is. Oh, one of these. Okay. closed. Next one. Stay away from the spiders. They didn't see them spiders. Okay. I don't know where else we have um rifts to worry about. But after I get this rift done, I'm going to take a short break, turn my graphics up, restart the game. Oh, some Fate Touch. I always use Fate Touch still, right? I put the last Inquisitor and didn't have to deal with all these rifts. Bear demon. And a pride demon. Only one more wave to go. Oh, 
Oh, multiple pride demons. Lovely. Okay, I think we got it. I think we got it. Okay. Let's bring my save. And I'm just going to... um. Turn the graphics up and restart the game, so I'll be right back. See on the flip side. Okay, I think I... I think I don't need to have, like, super low graphics now. Okay, next rift. Any more rifts I have to worry about? Let's set one last rift. Okay. And it's this way. So let's run away from the spiders. I did a little quick battle test with a couple of spiders to see if everything was working right. It looked like everything was working okay enough. More spiders. I don't like them too much. I don't know why to start doing that last week. But at least it should be. Oh, another spider. More spiders. I want to get away from the same spiders. I don't want to be fighting every five steps because of spiders. This is why I don't like the spiders in this game. There's too many of them. Ooh, cave. Can I go through this cave? Read. It still tastes, tastes strange no matter what. It does have water stained pages. Have we traveled to lands more remote than these? We must have. I can have never felt so removed from life back home as I do now. T makes the same arguments as always, though adds the lack of demons as a point in her favor. Lack isn't absence, which I was quick to point out. She called me pithy. There are demons here, though not as many as we faced in those early years together. The Avar have their mages too. The last were ill prepared for me. I wonder if that's the part that bothers here. Oh, as always, was no help at all. We push on, my head aches. The others are singing the song we learned at that lakeside town. I forget the name of the place. I think my eyes are about to explode. Of course, has noticed and tells the others he needs to read something. It's quiet now. The journey here took longer than expected. I must take stock of the rations after sleep. They were more than expected. Everything has been more than expected. A few moments later and O would not be standing here. I was able to subdue the mage before things became worse. T said nothing about it afterwards. She knows O would have died. At what cost? He asked me that once. I said they cost nothing. 
but I don't know. I met a man who'd fought longer than I, but his mind had faded with age, and he could not answer. The point remains that I can do more. I can be more effective. We've all seen the demons, what they did. We've seen what some others would do with blood. The question is, who pays the cost if no one takes this chance? And no one said it has to be forever, just until things are settled. If you count eight times, will the number change? O asks. She's been watching me these last few days. Whatever she says to the contrary, damned blue bottles, I did not plan this journey as well as I should. Templar. Lyrium. I lay trying to find consolations through the leaves. T brought me some water. She just smiled. There was no admonishment behind it. It made me feel somewhat better, as always. A cooked our dinner while deriding my own ability to produce something edible. O attempts to tell jokes. Make her their pathetic. Why do they make me laugh anyway? Long days behind. I fear there are fewer ahead. Whatever costs I've paid, they will be worth it. It doesn't matter. This night, safe beha beside a fire, the three of them singing that stupid song, I am content. Templar with his friends. Uh, if this be our last night together, let it end in laughter. Atho. Okay, I'm not going to read all that. Is that the only entrance to the cave? Something there's like a passage. I know there is one that is a passage. But it's not this one. Okay. Well, back out. Maybe. No, I don't think I came in this way. Not near my camp. Get across this river and get away from the spiders. Let's get away from the spider lake or spider river. Spider river. Yeah, it doesn't work as well. It needs only one syllable. Not going to worry about the shards just yet. We'll get the storyline of this soon. I just want to make sure rifts are closed. Because rifts are problems. And those are kind of problems I do not want to have. There it is. Afterwards, I'm going to go look out, look for the um, friendly Avar. <clears throat> Sorry. Thank 
keep this thing over here. There we go. Closing this rift. I hate those things. Okay. So let's start with um that one, and that's all the way over here. And you can hit this camp. Okay. You know what, let's go to the fishing village too while we're here. They're like right over there, it's not a problem, it's not far. Actually, what's my inventory looking like? Oh, plenty of space. I have plenty of space. Hi there. Sorry about murdering your guests. You are the lowlander they call Inquisitor. I am Arvid Rolfson. Hello, Arvid. The fish will feed on fool's heart wine this night. I know not what brings you here, but we have no quarrel. You and I. No, oh, that's good. So, how long have you been here? How long have you lived in the basin? Stone Bear Hole's been here a few generations. I was born further north, but we left before I could remember. It was a good life, until the jaws of Hacken arrived. They brought trouble with them. No, they usually People do. People were expecting a raid, but... You don't agree? They seem bigger fools than that, for all their boasting. I cannot say what they plan, but it bodes ill. So, can I borrow a boat? I find myself in need of a boat. I need to reach that island. The lady's rest. What? That island belongs to the lady of the skies. The spirits warn us to leave it be. Of course they do. Um, it is important that I go there, though. I don't wish to disturb your lady, but it's important. If I give you the boat, and you anger the spirits and die, other lowlanders may come for blood. That is trouble for my holder, not my trouble to take. Go to Stone Bear Hole and speak with my Thane, Svara Sunhair. Get her blessing, and you may sail to Korth's rocky heart, if you wish. Oh, thank you. Okay. See, very pleasant. That's what you get for being nice.
I figure since I'm right here. Go on my lovely horse. It's quite beautiful over here. I think I just knocked over a poor Tuskit. I hope it's alive. Didn't mean to kill you if I killed you. Sorry about that. marking the world i'm surprised any demons nearby do not fall back through it would be a simple matter for such misguided creatures to return to their home and leave this confusing world behind would that not be easier for everyone involved my dear demons can't hear you it hurts too much nothing here makes sense to them <sighs> yeah, that's true can you want something there? Doesn't mean it's gonna happen there, Biv. Threat of cold in the air today. All the rams are growing thick coats. It'll be a bad winter. Oh, that's lovely. It's a weird winter in the real world. He sounds very pleasant. Now, might I have a word? We've heard of your arrival, Lowlanders. Come, share my fire where we might speak. I am Svara Sunhair, Thane of Stone Bear Hold. You have guest welcome here. Oh, that's thank the you. The Lowlanders have little love for your Dalish clans. I am impressed you came to lead their inquisition. You yeah, it's just because they're a bunch of religious fanatics of in nutcases. Ah. Ah, we noticed. Yes. Given what we faced getting to your hold, we are nowhere near safety. We have learned that the last Inquisitor may have died here hundreds of years ago. We seek his body. Giving peace to the dead is a worthy quest. Any help we can offer is yours. Sadly, the jaws of Hakon will not offer so warm a welcome. You have met their thane, Gerd Harrison. I wager you have crossed blades with the jaws of Hakon in the wilderness. Many times. You would search this place for your Inquisitor's body. They will want you to pay in blood. So... Um, what was this, uh... Contest I saw. When I first entered your hold, there was a climbing contest of some sort. What was that? The test of the lady. We use it to settle disputes when it is not clear who has the right of it. There are others. For the test of the mountain father, you battle with verse while those who favor you hold you aloft. Oh, that's the lovely. The test of Hakon is battle with blunted weapons. Yeah, it seems about as reasonable as anything else. Seems as fair a way as any to decide such matters. In many cases, the law is clear. The tests are only for real disputes. As Thane, I may guide the gods in finding who is worthy. 
I decide which test will settle the dispute. I may also ask a warrior whose claim is foolish to climb with stones strapped to his back. So, I'll, I'll talk about this later. Can we get a boat? I needed your permission to borrow a boat from the fishermen. Ah, Rolfson, he worries like a scared baby goat. The boat is yours. Tell him I said so. Oh, thank you. I'll speak with you later. Fair hunting. Okay. Have you seen the animals the jaws of Hakon keep? Rat things. I'm just gonna go get my boat. Head to the island. And then I'm gonna go back to Skyhold for a bit. Got work to do there. And maybe I'll even judge the prisoner. Okay, all three all, all three of these tuskets are still alive. I only knocked it over. Oh good I didn't. Sorry about running into you there. Race ya. I think it's winning. There you go. Now I'm winning. I'm good at racing Tusket. That's why they're saying that. Yeah. So, can I use your boat? Thane Sunhair gave me guest welcome at Stone Bear Hold. Aye, she sent word. As a guest, then, may I please borrow your boat? We would be poor hosts to refuse. The boat is yours. I hope you come back alive. So do I. Okay, take the boat. Row, row, row your boat gently across the lake. Hopefully I don't get attacked by another spider. Uh, nobody's been here for a while, it looks like. Okay. They watched the dead and dying, pressing close, clustered to hear, and forgot how to go back. Thanks for that call. Spirits. Okay, um... I'm gonna save here. We've looked everywhere else on this island. We have? We see what's inside the rift. Okay. No, oh, coal's already in there. Talana slept. I slept. To find you. 
dreamed him in dreaming. But I... The blood. I'm... She's gone. Talana wanted to reach Ameridan again. One more time. But she couldn't. I couldn't. I died. I tried to stay, but only pieces came through. You open the sky for the rest of me. That's what I do. Cole? Cole, can you help make sense of this? It hurts. She hurt. The wraiths knew only the pain, but she knew why. Daring, dreaming into darkness for a Meriden. A Meriden? Yes. Inquisitor. Beloved. I, she, came with a Meriden to hunt the dragon. One of his parties. Huge power like none had seen. It came from the mountains with the Abba. Towns fell. All dead. One last favor for Emperor Draco. Slay the Abba dragon. Save or lay. This wasn't just a hunt. Inquisitor Emeridum was here on orders from Emperor Draken. Yes. Yeah. A, a secret. Drawn by the dragon. Talana. I didn't want to, but where Emeridum goes, I go. They fought at the shore. Spirits and magic. Cold. So cold. How I found her. How she found us. They rested here, then up the river. Metal spires, a way to stop the dragon. Then Talana returned here, alone, to wait for him. Forever waiting, dreaming, then dead. Well, you can rest now. We'll find a Meriden. You don't have to wait here anymore. You did what she wanted you to. You can let go of her now. Thank you. It was hard. I... She... Went a long time ago. I stayed because she asked. Her things are there. She wanted them found. Talana. Uh, <clears throat> Whosoever reads this message, let it be known that the bearer, Inquisitor Meriden, commander of the Seekers of Truth, Travels to the Frostback Basin on the official request of His Divine Majesty Cordelis Dracon, Emperor of Orlais, upon business vital to the safety and security of this most holy empire, and that he and those who travel with him are to be afforded every service, rendered every assistance, and extended every courtesy in their efforts to protect Orlesian lives from threats both magical and mundane. Make her watch over him. Cordelis Dracon the First. Now oh, that was weird. Okay. Let's get back to the boat. And then back to Kendrick. And past these of our Hackenite. It is? Where?
Okay, get some good loot. As long as they don't sink my boat, we should be good. Can I do have to return that boat? I think they want me to return their boat. I would imagine they would want me to return their boat. So I'm returning their boat. Okay, oh, somebody's uh, the quest marker's over here. Runa should be here. Where did she get to? Somewhere to be missing? Are you looking for someone? My cousin Runa. She's off north climbing the hills instead of helping with the cats again. Farewell. Good day to you. Okay, back to Professor Kenrick. Ah, back to the camp. And Skyhold. <laughs> He's still walking. You walk slowly. May I help you, Inquisitor? Well, we've been to the island. The spirits on the island held the memories and possessions of a Meriden's lover. A woman named Talana. It told us that Emeridan was here on orders from Emperor Draken himself. And where he went next. On Drosty's dimples. I may have received tenure from that sentence alone. Emeridan had a lover. Talana, you said. The Inquisitor's Lady Mage. There was such debate over whether she existed. And there were Dorian, you're my Lady Mage. This was a request from Draken? This changes everything. Well, what does Talana change? You were surprised to hear that Emeridan had a lover. Yes, this Talana you mentioned. Her existence has been hotly debated. Some scholars took Inquisitor Emeridan's respect for the Chantry to imply that he remained celibate. In ages past, there were stories about him and his lover, a mage. They made it out to be a star-crossed romance. The Chantry silenced the stories strenuously. Makes sense. What does it change, knowing that Emeridan was on a mission from Emperor Draken? Everything. One current theory holds that Emeridan was selfishly throwing off his responsibilities to go hunting. Another suggests Draken had him removed or even killed because Emeridan opposed the Navaran Accord. But if this is true, then Emeridan was a loyal servant of Orlais. He was not an embarrassment. He was a patriot protecting Orlais while Draken fought in the Second Blight. You don't have a problem receiving information from spirits. It's not ideal, but since you found corroborating physical evidence, I see no serious issues. Any study of great wars and battlefields carries an inherent risk of contact with demons or spirits. When spirits are willing to talk, most historians love the chance of a first-hand report. So what do we do now? At the very least, we've found something to work with. The spirit said to follow the river to the north. And something about spires or spikes. Mm. Up the river. Um, the scouts have had trouble with Hakonites up there. I'll continue my research, but for now, your guess is as good as mine. Okay. So, see you in a bit. I'll speak with you later. And now... Back to Skyhold. Oh, I do want to judge Samson after last week. Oh, and empty out my inventory. And other stuff. Um, what else? Empty out my inventory. Judge. Deal with operations. That's what I was going to do. 
and then back to it. So I'll start with the inventory. Then we'll do the judging. I'll clear out the inventory soon. Sell the valuables. Turn in research. I come on judge the prisoner first. And then I'm going to do operations. Give me, Inquisitor. For personal interest, I have relieved Josephine, as you might expect. Yep. Knight Templar Samson, general to Corypheus, traitor to the Order. The blood on his hands cannot be measured. His head is too valuable to take. Kirkwall, Orlay, many would see him suffer. I can't say I'm not one of them. Ah, oh, well, this is serious. Judging him will affect as many as his crimes. I won't take it lightly. The Red Lyrium will steal your vengeance. You know what it does. Corypheus only delayed my corruption. Are you still loyal to that thing? He poisoned the Order. Used them to kill thousands. Yeah. Templars have always been used. How many were left to rot like I was after the Chantry burned away their minds? Piss on it. I followed him so Templars could at least die at their best. Same lie as the Chantry. The Prophet just isn't as pretty. Well, she thinks you're pretty. I don't know what to do. I found your people. They believed in you. Believed your cause was righteous. Not your business, Inquisitor. Your friend Maddox was so loyal he killed himself for you. They were always going to die. I saw what Corypheus was doing. So yes, I fed them hope instead of despair. I made them believe their pain had purpose. Just like the Chantry does. <laughs> right, Commander. It ended as well as anything else I've done. Corypheus would kill me on sight. I'll tell your people what they want. Everything I cared about is destroyed. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. I could let Kirkwall have him. But they're probably still busy cleaning up, so it's going to take a while for them. I don't really think I should exile him. I'll be letting him go. Giving him to the dwarf. I'll let Colin handle this. Very well. Samson, you will spend your remaining years serving the Inquisition. Cullen will be your handler. Perhaps he can get something useful out of you. I doubt the commander believes there's anything worthy left in me. You're not wrong, but you serve something greater than yourself once. Perhaps you can be made to remember that. Well, be a merciful. Okay. Up to the table. Okay. 
Okay, operations. And Solus approved, which is good. I don't know if I can't I can still get his quest or not. I would like to. But I'm not gonna restart just to do it. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, I'm going to go to that one. I'm going to go with the eagle-eyed. Bum. Men lit extra campfires, marched with rattles on their boots, and used a few other tricks to inflate our apparent numbers. Thanks to Sister Liliana's scouts, we even took a small venatory force by surprise. They were so busy counting our numbers that they didn't see the rest of the chargers coming in behind them. Venatory had a map. They were looking for something in the area. I passed it to Sister Liliana for perusal. Lieutenant Cremisius. Uh, Cremisius. Chromisius. Chromisius. A classy. A classy. I don't know. Okay. You're concerned. The consequences of drinking from that well. <sighs> Never mind. Okay. I'm gonna go with Liliana on the or Josephine on this one. Skywatcher. To work. And Liliana. Let's see what we have. There we go. I have to get some approval from Sky Bear Hold. Or Stone Bear Hold. Okay. Find Colette. And she's going to be over here, so that camp should be the best. Sorry. I'm going to try to get as much done as possible tonight. Trails of Hacking is not going to be done tonight, though, I can tell you that much. A lot of stuff in this one. Astrariums, Ocularums. Spiders. Okay, so... As long as it doesn't attack us. Uh, Colette is hopefully not in the. I, don't, I know she's not in the swamp. So, to be honest, I'm going to see if I can find a way around the swamp. More Hackenites.
Okay. Take care of those Hackenites. Oh, we hacked those Hackenites, but hacked good. Hacking good, yeah. It's up there somewhere, I believe. Just want to stay around the swamp. I know I can, I think I can get to her. I think I can. Might be able to get to her tonight. I don't know. I think I have to get up here all the way though. Go to over here. I can get myself over there, huh? Doesn't look like it's gonna be easy. Swords! To legs! The big swords! Got yourself uh, glitched out of the, the, the world, huh? Fail fire. What's this for? Gotta be a reason for the veil fire to be there. Nope, okay. Gotta get up there. Nope, okay. Hmm. Maybe there's a cave or something around here.
wonder where that... There's something that would require me to, you know... Um... Need the Veil Player for, like, a rune or something. Oh no, she's not up here. I know where she is. God. I'm going to have to go back down there. I'll find her. And then when I find her, that then I'll... Then I'll end up for the night. She's just... Down in there. She is in the swamp. I just need to find a way down into the swamp here. Preferably a way that's not going to kill me. Well, we're going to try. Hi. Oh, you're welcome. I'm Colette, Professor Kenrick's research assistant. I was hoping to conduct a survey of a Tavinta ruin in the hills. I may not have chosen the best route. So tell me about this ruin. hoping to find the ruin? The Tavinta's time here was brief, but their architecture endured, offering shelter, forming landmarks. Ancient Avar would have encountered these structures, which certainly predate Inquisitor Emeridan. Evaluating the ruins could offer insight into the region's history, once I can get set up. You're still going there? I've read everything we have on Ameridan, and studied up on new excavation techniques. I won't waste this opportunity. If you've a map, I can show you my destination, if you'd be interested in the findings. Oh, I would be. Stay safe. I will. Gonna loot the bodies. Ooh, fate touched. <sighs> okay.
And this is where all the travel to. Actually, I'm going to mark. Back to Skyhold. And then we'll end it for the night officially. I'm going to do this again next week. Because I'm still going to play Dragon Age Inquisition. It looks like I got at least got some kind of solution. I'm going to see if I can get Weirudo to work with my phone. Because that's the solution right now. I've got um, VC face on. And it's taking the data from VTube Studio, you know, the phone, um, the Android version of VTube Studio. Because I, I, I don't, I don't have a, I don't have an iPhone. Maybe I can check that out. So, um, I'll be back on Wednesday. With, well, back to making my, um, cosplay head. I want to try to get as much of that done as possible this week. I'm going to try. Whether or not I succeed, I don't know. But I'm going to try to get as much done as possible. And, um... Yeah, that's about it. So, oh yeah, and I'll be back Monday with Dragon Support, Dragon Age, Inquisition, Jaws of Hakan. So, until then... I hope you have a nice beginning of the week, and I will see you on the flip side. Bye.